Day 40 plusers, we're doing so schwa. Which, this name is a little ridiculous because you would never say something is so choice in French. Uh, it's just not how the vernacular fits together. Um, so selection doesn't work either because that's what it it actually means is selection right so <clears throat> so choice so selection it just doesn't work as a name I'm saying so, um, so this is my first so schwa say schwa mm -hmm. and it's a little jewelry box type container in the lid they confirm which items out of your selection queue you received. Um, you can zoom in and see what I got here. And a lot of this are things that I have used. And I wanted to confirm the quality against items I already have. So um, I have Lancome eyeliner pencils, so I want to confirm that. Uh, I actually, the Bobbi Brown Balsam Eyeshadow, I have that in a single, so I want to confirm the quality. Um, the Hourglass Canvas um, Lip Gloss, I have that, so I'm going to confirm that. Um, I do not have the lip liner, so that's, I can't compare. And the Guerlain Meteorite Pearls, I wanted to see how they presented a sample for a product that is difficult to split up, right? All these little good sized balls of color. So once you get into it, it looks like this. Everything's uh, hot glued down. So first thing is I've got this little pot of Guerlain Meteorites. And it's got a piece of cotton in there to keep them from rattling around anymore. Oops. That's probably why. And these smell lightly of violet. And they're wonderful. And looks like I have to find where that other one went. Uh, blue, pink, green, and yellow. And the pearl. It smells so good. That is one splurge item that I am always, I've been tempted for two years to get and I just haven't actually clicked uh, check out with it in my cart. But maybe, maybe this will drive me to do that. So I need to put it in something bigger and flat so that I can get a powder brush in there. Woo. Um, Bobbi Brown's uh, Balsam Eyeshadow. I put it shallowly in a pot. Um, you can put this in a Z palette. And over the top they have a secondary seal. You can see it's not very full, but the color did match. Um, now, with it being depotted, repressed, it was, I didn't think, as shiny as the metallic didn't come through as much. Um, it's less brilliant. It's a little more olivey. There it is on my finger. See what I mean? It's just not as brill. It's more olive toned. Um, then in this uh, twist up um, with a kind of cotton tipped lip gloss 
adapter thingy is the hourglass um, canvas. And I used the twist up, product came up, and then it stopped coming up. So it didn't just keep ex erupting like some of them do. So that's a good amount. I mean, I might get uh, a week out of that. Um, so next is the Lancome eye pencil. And it come, what they do is they take a black cap, take a nubbin, and glue it in so you actually have something to hold on to. There it is, Lancome and Moss, and then they give you a cap. Okay, so that's one, two, three, four. Fifth item in here is, I'm going to have to take some pliers to it, I think. So, it comes out of the black cap, but I cannot get the lip liner. I even nod on it with my teeth to try to pull it out. Out of the white cap to actually use. So I might have to heat it up, break the this off with a pair of pliers or something. I don't know. I just don't know. Anyway, so that without some effort isn't usable or testable at all. But Overall, uh, it arrived unbroken, unmolested, uh, intact, and I'm good with the everything except that the depot and repotting and repressing on the metallic eyeshadow took some of the luster away. You know, it's nowhere near as lustrous. Um, so that's my so schwa, say schwa. Be happy, be healthy, learn something new every day. If you have any questions or anything that you want me to actually add to the queue for these items, let me know. Ciao for now.